What is going on everybody? Hello and welcome to today's video. For those of you who don't know who I am, my name is Joey White and I'm a college basketball player at St. Mary's University of Minnesota. And so for today's video, we've got another game day vlog coming up. So today we're playing a team called University of Wisconsin Lacrosse. Uh, they're currently ranked like number four in the nation, I think, something like that. So um, definitely a very good team. It's going to be a tough one for us tonight, but uh, uh, hopefully we can pull out a big win and uh, get this on our get this on our record and and uh, keep it moving forward. But so, anyways, um, without further ado, just go ahead and just get on into this video. So I just had a little bit of breakfast, just finished up eating, and uh, I read for a little bit. So um, I'm an analytics major, obviously, so I'm very interested in analytics and obviously basketball as well. And uh, so I've been reading this book called Basketball on Paper. Uh, I don't know if any of y'all are interested in analytics or advanced metrics for like basketball statistics and everything, but man, if you are, definitely got to check this book out. It's like the holy grail for teaching like the ins and outs of like basketball analytics and statistics and everything so yeah very interesting book just started reading it a little while ago definitely a game changer but anyways uh we've got shoot around walkthrough at noon today so um it's almost like a 11 so uh, i'm gonna head over in probably like 30 minutes so i'm probably gonna eat some lunch here soon quickly just something a little bit before walkthrough and then uh, head on over to the head over to the locker room, the facilities, get all ready for for a shoot around, so then we can uh, get going with the rest of the day. So yeah, I'm gonna get to it. Catch up with y'all in a little bit. I right for wrong on a song. I let my heart bleed on my sleeve through microphones. I'm trying to write my wrongs. I'm writing out my wrongs. Ran through a check because it's hard to live off bread alone. So if you see me slipping, yeah, yeah, let me know. Cause it ain't the end of times yet. I know, but it's getting close. Yeah, I need my space to breathe. That's why I be going ghost. I ain't trying to stay up on that wide road. Cause I can't let them take my soul. Nah, 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 no. Oh, I can't let them take my soul. Nah, 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 no. I can't let them take my soul. Nah, 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 no. Oh, I can't let them take my soul. Nah, 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 no. They thinking I'm bluffing, but I promise I do it. All right, y'all. Well, we just finished up with shoot around and walk through. So now I'm going to get in my car quick, head up back over to the apartment, work a little bit for my internship at home, and then uh, head to class at 255. So I got to get going, catch up with you guys when I get back to the apartment. All right, guys. So I just finished up working for my internship. So now I'm going to head back over to campus. I got class at 255 with Nick. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to meet up with Nick and then head on over to class. We got Spanish. So uh, yeah, it's like our, our last class of the semester before finals. So um, yeah, it should be a fun one, I guess. And then we're going to get on the bus after that and head to the game. But all right, so I'm going to leave uh, the apartment now, head over to campus and catch up with Nick before class. So I will catch up with you guys in a little bit. Nick, you just finished up your last class. Now that you're graduating a semester, how, how are you feeling? Um, it's weird. Uh, I feel old and old right now. Um, three and a half years from the making. Finally, my last class. At, uh, but now, are you ready for a big game tonight? I am. I look cross. Hopefully, get it done. Yes, sir. Full cards, baby. All right, so I'm down in the locker room now. Just packing up everything into my bag before we get heading onto the bus and get heading over to the game. So I'll catch up with you guys at the game. Bro, there's no way we're right.
evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome into University of Wisconsin Lacrosse and the Mitchell Hall Gymnasium as we get set for tip off tonight between the visitors from St. Mary's University in Winona, Minnesota, and your host here, the number seventh ranked team in the country, according to D3Hoops.com, the University of Wisconsin Lacrosse. St. Mary's in their road blues. Eagles in their home whites, starting for St. Mary's tonight. Number four, Bruce Lockwood. Number 10, Raheem Anthony. Number 11, Brayton Beisman. Number 15, Jabari Sawyer. And number 23, Owen Ziegler. Starting for the Eagles, number three, Will Furman. Number four, Ethan Anderson. Number five, Craig Steele. Number 23, Austin Westra. And number 32, Torin Hanna. Austin Westra up and wins the tip. And the Eagles are on offense. Into the hands of the leading scorer, Raheem Anthony. Gets into the lane, lays it up with the left hand up and good for Anthony to show for it as Westra kicks it into the corner to Will Furman. He'll rise and fire from three and buries it. With the ball on the baseline, kicks it over in the corner to Beisman. Three ball going up from the corner and the Cardinals answer right back. Beisman buries it on top to Raheem Anthony. Hannah shuffling his feet, trying to cut off Anthony. Ziegler hands off to Beisman. Five on the shot clock. Fade away from Beisman. In and in. Thought Wester two of three in the early going. Four points as the Eagles lead nine to seven. Sawyer kicks it over to Beisman. Beisman for three, and he's hot to start the game. He's got eight points. Anthony guarded by kick. 13 on the shot clock, over to Ziegler. Ziegler looking for space on the perimeter. Flip back to Anthony for a dunk. Hannah over to kick. Craig Steele into the lane, step back, 15 footer, buries it. 12 on the shot clock. Screen, slip pass down to Westra, seven on the shot clock. He's got time up and under, scoops it back up to his right hand. Little unorthodox there for Austin Westra. Pump fake. Shot clock at five, Ziegler. Looking for room, he steps back and he buries it. I think that's gonna be a two just in front of the line to Anthony. Frechette to Beisman. Beisman cut off by Gross, but he'll hit from 19 feet. Westra working baseline on falls. Spins back to his right hand up for Westra and good, Westra. Screen set by falls, Anthony with a push off there on Westra, no call. Mallory lines one up from the corner and he buries it. Back to Westra, Westra thought about a three. Gonna try baseline, spins back to his right and he scoops his way all the way in, count the basket for Austin Westra. Anthony to Mallory. Guarded by Resch, Resch with a good contest, but a good rise and fire there by Cameron Mallory. Under 10 on the shot clock, down to seven. Falls here in the corner. Beisman with a long three, and he connects. Back to Beisman, Anthony gets it back, looking to dump it into the post to Noah Frechette. Frechette spins his way to the baseline, and that will cause a timeout here for the Eagles. They trail by seven, loss of the season against Trine. Anthony backdoor pass to Beisman. Beautiful job there by the Cardinals. Noon looking for Siebert. Siebert will stop and pop. Front iron gets it to go. High off the backboard. The gets a screen here from Bruce Lockwood. And now Furman out on Sawyer. Sawyer all the way into the lane, into the basket. And a contest, but a basket good there by Sawyer. For Anderson over to Schwartzoff. Furman pump fake. Gets a shot off at the horn. In and out for the Eagles. And that's been the story of the first half so far. In and out for the majority of the half. Their shooting percentage down under 39%. And they trail the Cardinals 32 to 28 here. Halftime at Mitchell Hall. Halftime clock is winding down as we get set for second half action here at Mitchell Hall. It's been Lockwood. And Raheem Anthony starting the second half here for the Cardinals. Sibley gets it all the way up to the basket, high off the square and in over the top. Back out to Sawyer, right back to Anthony. 15 on the shot clock. 
kicked out to Sawyer and rattles home a three, five points here in the early going for Jabari Sawyer. Beisman out to Ziegler. Ziegler three ball from the corner and buries it. And the lead is at 10 here for the Cardinals. Sawyer guarded by Anderson. Curls to Beisman who rises and fires and gets it to go through traffic there. And the Cardinals starting to feel it here a little bit. Over to Craig Steele. Steele back to Henry Noon. Noon gets a look at a three and buries it. Right in front of the Eagles bench. Raheem Anthony with the ball. Britton Beisman cuts through. Sibley under 10 on the shot clock. Rash spins, flips it up and count the basket for the Cardinals. Rash, Hannah. Back to Henry Noon. He'll take another three and buries it. Henry Noon with a couple of threes to get the offense going here for the Eagles. They Screen here coming from Falls. He won't use it. He'll take it the opposite way. Met at the rim and a good job defensively, but a putback can't get it to go. Falls brings it down and he gets the basket for the Cardinals. Torin Hanna guarding Raheem Anthony. Anthony gets a baby hook to go with the left hand. 20 on the shot clock. Into Noah Frechette. Frechette over to Mallory. Mallory cuts it into the lane. Loses it, but falls there. Right place, right time again. He puts it in with the left hand, and the lead is at 11. 15 on the shot clock. Wester with the ball on the perimeter. Trying to spin on Falls. Anderson over to Henry Noon. Another look at three. Buries it. Henry Noon, three of three from three-point range. Hand off to Noon. Over to Hannah. Anderson, baseline. He'll pull up. Jumper, good for Ethan Anderson. Good for Ethan to see one go through the net with Henry Noon on him. Under 10 on the shot clock. Screen comes from Falls, working over the top. Over to Sawyer. Sawyer puts up a deep three at the buzzer. Just in front of the shot clock horn, and he buries it. Into Westra. Westra with 19. Henry Noon. Back to Austin. 10 on the shot clock. Noon takes another one from deep. Buries it! Henry Noon, fourth free throw, excuse me, fourth three-pointer of the second half, and the lead is down to four. Over to Beisman. Ten on the shot clock. Sawyer. Noon got a hand on it, had to recover out onto Beisman, who makes him pay with a three. Over to Ethan, he'll take a three. Off the back iron, rebounded by Torin Hanna. He can't hang on to it, stays with Sibley, or excuse me, Sawyer. Raheem Anthony gets a left block up and good. Off the back iron, rebounded by Mallory. Blocked by Austin Westra. Picked up by Lockwood, out to Bodysman, and a big three there. Eagles thought they had a momentum play, but Bodysman makes him pay. And a turnover here, pushing in transition, Anthony with it. And a dunk over the top of Ethan Anderson. And it's back to 10 points here, the lead for the Cardinals. 67-57, timeout on the floor, called by Ken Dernbach. Gets it in to Ethan Anderson, 10 on the shot clock. Anderson, step back from the baseline, gets it to go. And work efficiently here on offense. Henry Noon, Westra. Westra powers his way to the basket, up and in. Mallory. 10 on the shot clock, Westra. As Mallory stops, spins, and lays it in. Hannah, up to Westra. Furman, acrobatic layup there for Furman, gets it to go. This one off the backboard, rebounded by Ethan Anderson. Will Furman to Henry Noon. He'll stop and pop, buries it from deep. 18.2 seconds to go. Eagles down by five. He off the iron. Six seconds remaining. And the Cardinals will dribble it out on a big road win here for St. Mary's University. The Eagles fall at St. Mary's 73 to 66.
J Mo and Milo. We start to have two in a row. Lacrosse K, by the way. Lax K. Lax K. Dude, that's a dude. And the ref's like, hey, what you think? He's like, oh. He said he goes like, bro. Technical. Technical. Yes. Hey, oh, no. <laughs> Raheem, right, right Anthony featuring, you know, J Mo and Milo, you know. I'm not gonna lie. Bruce Lockwood. Yeah, we got him. Yeah, bro. I got it. All right, all right, all right. Right. Put the camera on number 11 over there. Number 11 right there? That man. Bucket. That man's a bucket right yeah, there. Yeah, You see this man right here? Put the camera on him. He's been rebounding today. He rebounded today. Good job, man. We're proud of you. you guys so i'm eating the the post game meal now we just got back to campus that was a crazy game we played easily the best game we've played all year so it was a big game uh they were a top five team in the country i think so um yeah it was a really big win for us um hopefully uh we can carry this uh momentum on to the next ones but yeah it was just a, the whole team was locked in everyone was playing really well especially defensively it was a big game for us, and we all had a, all had a bunch of fun, and uh, yeah, it was a great game. So, I'm gonna mow this food down because I am incredibly hungry right now. But yeah, so I'm gonna enjoy this food real quick, head back to the apartment, and then uh, yeah, I'll probably just catch up with you guys when I'm back there. All right, you guys. So uh, it's a couple of days later now. Um, yeah. So as you know, we are coming off a really big win. You know, it was big for us to get a win against the top 10 nationally ranked team in the country. So, um, yeah, this is big for us. Uh, we have another big big game coming up against a really good team um, in our holiday little trip thing that we're going on. So um, hopefully we can string together another win with that, put two really good wins together, and then uh, keep, keep moving. So, um, yeah, uh, this is where I'm probably going to wrap this video up so um i appreciate you guys if you're still sticking around um and if you haven't yet please make sure to like this video and subscribe to the channel because it helps out way more than you possibly think um definitely make sure to stay tuned because i'm gonna be posting videos for hopefully every game now um so there's gonna be a lot coming so uh definitely stay tuned and uh, i appreciate all of you guys way more than you know and i'll catch you in the next one